The music of Sting is coming to stage right here in Denver. Message in a Bottle is a performance that perfectly combines Sting's music with a story about empathy and kindness. Mm, sounds fantastic. Dylan Thomas learned the story might hit close to home with our country's current crisis at the border. The music of Sting is so iconic, um, whether you know it from the police or whether you know it from all of uh, his work as a solo artist. But for the first time, the best of Sting is being shared like never before in Message in a Bottle. What you're seeing is a visual feast of dance. Kate Prince, the show's director and choreographer, was tasked by Sting to turn his music into a powerful performance away from just a concert setting. It was too many songs, too many songs to choose from. But then she saw a photo of an immigrant child, a child who drowned while trying to flee Syria for a better life in Turkey. And that prompted me to want to try and create a fictional story, but based in truth about people who put their lives at risk and their children's lives at risk to cross open water in a tiny boat because where they live isn't safe. And so was born Message in a Bottle, a story of love, hope, human resilience, and survival, all told through Sting's music and dance. I don't like dance to have empty steps. I want the dance to say something. I want dancers to be able to grab in on a story and actually go somewhere with something. His songs already tell a story. They're, they are already quite political um, in their own right, and we've connected them together with a narrative. <laughs> Though the story was not inspired by or associated with the crisis at the U.S.-Mexico border, one could argue this message in a bottle is coming to Denver at just the right time. There is something really wonderful about how dance can express stuff where words can't, where words aren't enough. We could all do with a bit more empathy for people and to lead with a bit more love. I'm Dylan Thomas, covering Colorado First. And Message in a Bottle plays the Denver Center for the Performing Arts February 13th through the 25th. For more information on those tickets, just visit our website, cbscolorado.com. We'll be right back.